Hey folks, I recently found a uh, new taco seasoning at Walmart's. It's Mateo's Taco Seasoning, and this is their Mild Southwest Ranch. I had never seen this before, and uh, I like Mateo's uh, salsa. I've actually reviewed it in the past. I, I really think they have a good salsa. And this really intrigued me because it's a Southwest Ranch. It sounds different than like a, a you know Taco Bell or something that you know normally you would you would make at home. And it says uniquely different. So I'm gonna make this today. Now, I actually saw at Walmart which I bought the Mild Southwest Ranch. They also have a medium ancho chili fajita seasoning. It says coming soon. And a uh, hot chipotle taco seasoning coming soon. I guess that's coming soon to their website because Walmart had all three of these. And I decided to go with the, the mild because my wife doesn't like hot spicy food. So I thought I'd give this a try. So I'm gonna, gonna make a... Uh, Simple taco today. Give it a try. See what I think of it. And if I like it, I'll, I'll move on up to the, the, the spicier version. So let's go make some tacos. Okay, I've got a pound of ground beef that I've browned and drained. And I'm going to add this packet of the Mateo's taco seasoning. Southwestern Ranch. And then just give it a give it a good mix, stir it around. You can tell right off the bat it smells different. Yep, just mix it up really well. And then add two thirds of a cup of water. And then stir that to incorporate the everything and then I'm gonna turn the heat on bring it up to a boil give it another good stir make sure everything is mixed well okay now I'm gonna put a lid on it and turn it down to simmer and let it simmer for about five minutes six minutes whatever the packet said uh, three to five minutes Okay, it's been a little over five minutes. It looks good to me. It smells really good. Okay, turn that off. Okay, we're ready to go. Yeah, hmm, smells good. Let's build a taco. Okay, I've got a warmed flour tortilla here. Is that a, got a good amount of that uh, taco meat? And then some uh, shredded cheese. Like I said, this is just gonna be a simple taco. I didn't have any lettuce or tomato handy. Okay, let's go give it a try. Okay. Let's give it a try. It's a simple taco. Meat and cheese. This didn't have any, any lettuce or tomato to add to it, but that's fine. Let's grab it and not make a mess. Hmm, it's really good. I I like that flavor. It has it has more flavor than, uh, say, your, you know, your regular Taco Bell or your uh, old El Paso taco seasoning that you'd buy at the grocery store. I really like that. Um, I don't really get a ranch flavor, but I, I do get a little citrus there. I, I really like that. I think my wife will like this, but this is a mild, so it's up to me. I can kick it up, so course add a little bit of that green sauce from H-E-B 
Now, now we're cooking. Oh yeah, that's the stuff. That's good. That is real. That's a good combo right there. Really, the 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 green sauce real, real, the green sauce really brings out the flavor in that taco. Hmm. Okay, found a new taco sauce or new uh, taco seasoning that I really really like. I'm gonna be buying up some more of those, and uh, maybe I'll give the uh, the medium a try next time. Kind of sneak that in. There you have it, folks. There's Mateo's Southwest Ranch Taco Seasoning. Found that at Walmart. That's the only place I've seen it yet. I'm sure you can order it from their website. Thanks for watching.